Alright, so I hastily started my recording um, because I saw Pizzas was streaming and apparently there are custom lobbies on the Hive now. I don't know how, I don't know why. I literally just joined Pizzas stream, there was a code in chat and I joined it. So now I'm in a custom game, let's go. If you're wondering why this is being uploaded at an ungodly hour, just take it directly from Pizzas. Potato pies on up there. You guys better, if you're a small YouTuber, you better be recording this. What are you guys doing? Alright. Pretty much this is something so big and so hyped on the Hive that smaller YouTubers like me would be stupid to not record and upload something as soon as possible when it comes out. First, I'm going to show some gameplay of these custom games that we did, and then later in the video I'm going to talk about what this means for the Hive, how you can join custom games, and when we can expect to see these for the general public of the Hive. Also, be sure to leave a like on the video if you haven't done so already, and also subscribe if you're new to the channel, I'd really appreciate it and it'd mean a lot to me. Either way, enjoy. So this is Treasure Wars Megas. I'm pretty sure there are about 30 people on my team here. I'm not entirely sure though, but uh, <laughs> I don't know if I'm even going to be able to get gold to be completely honest. Oh wait, I forgot. Shops are free, so I just have free stuff. Easy clap. Um, I can't even access the shopkeeper. <laughs> it feels bad. Oh, I got it. Okay, cool. So everything's free, so we can just get a bow, a bunch of arrows. I now gotta uh, buy knockback, knockback, two block breakers. A bunch of pearls, snowballs, we got the whole works, okay? This is actually going to be chaos, oh my god. Wait, okay, we got a minion destroyed. I think it might be smart to defend. Actually, no, we're gonna go on the offensive. This, <laughs> just the fact that there's like everyone in here is actually insane. Oh my god. Wait, is that a thing that you can do? Wait. Oh, okay, they, they're they here, they're here. What is going on? I've never played anything like this before. Got one, uh, but I mean, I'm, I'm dead pretty much. Hmm. So I, how do we want to do this here? Uh, cause I'm just gonna, we don't have any treasure. We're just gonna get rolled. I don't know why he's placing down TNT. I'm dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeet. Did I make it? No. This is... Oh my god. Wow. Okay. Well, that was probably the most chaotic game of Mega Treasurers of all... Of all oh my god. <laughs> there are so many people in here. Oh my god. Guys, if you're recording, you know, just insert this clip. Oh. Subscribe. Subscribe to this channel. Leave a like if you're ready for the custom servers. Let's go. <laughs> All right, so what we've got this time, we have normal stuff, question mark? I'm not entirely sure. Emerald and diamond summoner speed. I don't know what those are at normally, so yeah, we'll see how this goes. Also, Splodger casually just hacking, flying around. All right, dude. <laughs> so is this just normal megas or what? Or can we just like buy from the shop right now? Okay, yeah, stuff actually costs- oh wait! Oh, this is like insanely limited resources I think because gold blocks aren't normally 10 gold. Oh shoot, okay, so we actually have to like- Alright, I want to ask what Splodger was thinking when he set up this lobby because I guess yeah, the diamond gen is quick but like the gold gens are really slow and everything costs so much in the shop. Interesting. That is a really fast diamond gen though. All right, I'm gonna go to here then and kind of yoink all the diamonds, maybe. Yoink, mine now. <laughs> all right, I'm sorry. I'll just I'll distribute the wealth though um, after I buy some stuff for myself. Um, so we'll buy iron sword. We'll buy um, buy armor and here I'll just toss that out for someone else to get. Oh my God, there are already so many red people at mid. Oh, emerald gen is actually really fast. I'm gonna three shot that guy though, yeah. Okay, now I have blocks actually. This is fine. This guy's lagging around, alright. Actually, I have six M's. I could probably get a few more and then get diamond and just kind of tank the rest of the game. Everyone's sumoing. Wait, I gotta kill GG Gamer. Ooh, actually, this is bad. This is really bad. No, never mind. It's not. I'm fine. Diamond gen's so fast though. Oh my god. I'm just yoinking all of everyone's stuff. 
I'm gonna get full diamond soon, unless full di unless diamond cost was increased. Oh, it was actually. I just realized because the iron armor cost was uh, increased as well. However, I should have enough now, I think. It's 28, so 28 times... Uh, oh, how does Nerd already have diamond? I'm gonna jump off with the emeralds. I don't care. <laughs> I have no health. I have no health. No health. No, I, I was so close to killing him. Either way, these games are like actually... This is so wild, like... These are so chaotic, but honestly, if you actually have like a decent following on YouTube, you can make these like really, really fun. Wait, I need a sword? And... Uh, no, I'm dead. I'm dead. Goodbye! Yep, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, this is like actually... This is so many players! This is actually insane how many people are in this, oh my god. So that's pretty much all the footage that I recorded myself, but I still do want to take a little bit of this video to talk about what this means for the Hive. So we mostly already knew that custom games were coming along with the Swarms update, which is kind of like Hypixel Guilds if you played on Hypixel at all. Pretty much there's going to be like a clan system and it's going to include custom games and the likes. I'm sure that a frequent question in the comments will be who gets to have access to these custom servers. Honestly, we don't really know right now. However, according to Pizzas. So yeah, custom servers coming soon. Stay tuned. It's going to be released to partners first. So you'll be seeing a lot of a... Uh... A lot of custom server of streams soon on yeah channel. on dicey's channel so like pizza said this is going to come out for partners and by partners he means people with youtube rank and i think there's also a streamer rank that not many people have but it exists so those people will get access to it first and you'll mostly see big youtubers like dicey's your boy action and patar all doing content with it before normal people like me and you are able to do anything with it we also really have no idea as to when this is going to be released to partners and the public just because all pizza is said is soon, and soon could mean tomorrow, or it could mean in a few weeks, or I don't know, it could be even Valve time where it means a couple of years. We don't know yet. Either way, I had a ton of fun with this impromptu recording. Big shout out to Pizzas for recommending that I record this, and also big shout out to Spodger for hosting these games for an early look at what is to come for the Swarms update. Actually, we can't we can't cancel Spodger because this is all hosted by him. He's put out the codes. This is all him. So uh, shout out to Mr. Splodger. If you see him in the lobby, like right here, like this guy, if you ever see him in the lobby, sometimes he's a big giant man. Um, if you ever Bro, see him I in the lobby, that. just thank him. Thank him for being awesome because that was just <laughs> so awesome. Either way, I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, all I ask is that you subscribe. It's free, and you can always unsubscribe later if you get tired of watching my content. However, I'm trying to put out really high-quality Hive videos that people want to watch, so look out for some really, really high-quality videos in the future. Either way, once again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.